we're back and this time I'm going to show you how to create a multiple stroke effect using graphic styles in Adobe Illustrator. Let's create a graphic style under view I've got a smart guide that's set to point activated and I use the line segment tool with the stroke and no fill. Let me zoom in and I'll open the stroke menu you will find that under window. And we want to have a round cap and a round join. Let me zoom in. This is what it does. And around join, you can't see that as we don't have multiple strokes with the join. But when we have a text, they will be there. So add that as well. Now open the appearance menu and add a couple of strokes. I want to have five in total. I'll just click on this icon at the bottom left until I've got five strokes. Let me change the fill color. So this is the inside. Now I increase the stroke weight for the second stroke. To double the size of the first one. And I always go five points higher with every stroke. And you can see how that is added to my line. And the final one, 25. Let's keep that. I'll close my window, make sure it's selected, and then go to your graphic styles. Again, you can find that under Windows. And just click on the new icon. And we've added it to our menu. Now use the type tool, type in some text. For example, multiple. As I set up, holding shift and alt. And now I click on my graphic style, and it's automatically applied. You can still change the font. As you can see, depending on the font that you use, you'll get different results as all of these fonts are created differently. And it's also important to check the size of your text. Let me show you this with another example. I'll just change the word with the editable. I'll change it to strokes and you can see on the R and on the K, We've got these smaller spots and we can fix them by using a smaller font weight. So a value down here in the properties menu. If you want to then size it up, it's a good idea to use it as a vector and copy paste it into a Photoshop file and then you can size it up there any smaller spots that will be gone even though you sized it back up. And this is how you can create a smaller stroke effect in Adobe Illustrator. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.